Hi, I'm Keith Bledsoe, and I'm the owner here at Smoky Mountain Traders. I personally go out and buy the best cars on the market for you, our customer. Please give us a call with any questions you may have. Hey everybody, it's Devin with Smoky Mountain Traders. I hope you're having a great day. Today we're going to be taking a close look at this 1968 Chevrolet Camaro. This car has had a beautiful restoration, features a big block under the hood, but we'll get to that here in a second. Remember, if you've got any questions, you can give us a call at 865-988-8088, or you can send us an email to sales at smtclassics.com. Now, I'm going to take you around the outside, on the inside, and under the hood of this Camaro, and then we'll get it on a lift and out on the highway as well. As you look across the front, you'll notice that all of your trim and stainless is beautiful. You can also see that the front bumper appears to be replaced along with the emblems. It'll also give you your first opportunity to look down the sides and you can see that they are straight as an arrow. As we come on around the driver's side of this 68, you can see that the body lines are beautiful on this car as well. You'll also notice that these door gaps are even and symmetrical and that the wheel opening and the rocker molding has been replaced. Before we go on around though, let's take a look on the inside. As you come up, you can see that it's accented by the blue interior, which provides a beautiful complement to this exterior color scheme. you also notice that it does have the bucket seats with the Hurst 4-speed shifter. The gauges in this Camaro are working and the dash pad's in great condition as well. You'll also notice that you've got the wood grain accents here that tie into the steering wheel. As we come on around, you can see that the door panels and the seat covers have been replaced, along with the carpet and the headliner. Now that we've been on the inside, we'll continue around the outside to give you opportunity to see how great that door shuts. Now as we come across the back, of course, you can see it's got the rear spoiler. It's also got the SS black inlay here, and you can see that the tail light bezels, lenses, and the rear bumper has been replaced. As we come on around the passenger side, I'll take a step back. That way you can get a real appreciation for just how gorgeous this car is. Now when it was restored, they'd redone it in the base coat, clear coat, and this fathom blue paint was accented by the white stripe here on the front. Now it has been buffed and polished to a gorgeous shine, and it's set off by the 15 inch rally wheels with the BF Goodrich Redline tires and new beauty rings and centers. Now if you want to come on up, we'll take a look at the heartbeat of this Chevrolet. Under the hood, everything has an absolutely beautiful detail. You'll notice that it even has the correct hose clamps and everything looks just like it would have from the factory in 68. Now it's set up with a 396 big block engine with the 350 horsepower call outs here on the breather. You'll also notice that it does have power steering and power brakes as well. Now that we've been around the outside, on the inside and under the hood of this 68, I'll get it pulled around there so that way you can take a close look at the bottom. Remember, if you've got any questions, you can give us a call at 865-988-8088 or you can send us an email to sales at smtclassics.com. Now let's get this Camaro around there so that way you can take a close look at the bottom and then we'll get it out on the highway for you as well. Now that this Camaro's up on the rack, we can take a close look at the bottom of it. As you can see, this car has had a frame off rotisserie restoration and they did an excellent job of showcasing how amazing it truly is. All of the floors are done in body color and have a phenomenal detail. Under the front, it has disc brakes and the 396 engine is mated to the T10 transmission. For exhaust, it has manifolds with dual pipes and the Flowmaster Crossflow muffler. Out back, you'll notice that the fuel tank has been replaced along with the fuel lines and the brake lines. Before we get this Chevy on the highway, I want you to take another close look at how solid all of the floors, frame, and rockers are. Thanks for visiting us at SmokyMountainTraders.com. If you're ever in East Tennessee, stop by and check us out.